Hey everybody, well I thought I would just share kind of an old school, <laughs> kind of like how I do all my cruise videos, do a quick little haul of some really cute shoes that I wanted to show you in my mirror. The only bad thing is I had to pull in my ring light so it's a little bit weird because um, it's raining here. But I wanted to show you these shoes and also let you know if you don't follow me on Instagram, you should because things that come back in stock or, or that are on sale, like a couple of these shoes I've shown on Instagram and I let you know when there was like 20% off or other codes. So that's a good reason to follow me on there because I can just quickly get on stories and say, hey, these are on sale or something's back in stock. So just something to keep in mind, but I realize not all of you follow me both places. So a couple of pair of these white jeans and some shoes I wanted to show you. So these white jeans are new. And I like to mention white jeans because I know so many of you wear white jeans in the spring and summer. So do I. I'm always on the, <clears throat> excuse me, hunt for like that next best pair. I have a couple pair that I like, but I'm always just on the hunt. So I wanted to show you these again, because these are my new ones. And I really think a lot of you are going to like them. Now they are a little bit pricier than some other brands that I've worn, but I think they're worth it because you got to look at the price per wear. And I like that they're a good thickness. So they're basically, it's like they're thick without being too thick. Cause I've bought some where they're too thick. They're not see-through. Now I did buy them in the shorter length. Um, length. When I first bought them, I bought them in the regular and they kind of like, jeans can kind of gape on me in the back of the knee anyway. And the regular length was just a little bit too much. And I like how these you can see are right slightly above the ankle. So I just think they would look good with all kinds of shoes. You can wear them with tennis shoes. I always get asked a lot, like how do I wear cute jeans, you know, and tennis shoes. The key is showing your ankle. Um, these run true to size, I believe. I will put all the details below, but definitely wanted to show you these because if you see me wearing them on Instagram and stuff, um, I wanted to let you know about them. So these shoes, I love a pop of color in a shoe and I just thought these were so cute. I did mention these briefly again on Instagram, just saying, you know, the day I bought them, took a quick pick in the store, but these are so cute. I think they come in another color. And again, I love a pop of red. They're super comfortable, really affordable. I think they were uh, under $25 maybe. So I just threw on this outfit to show you all of the shoes because it was just an easy thing um, to show. But wanted to show you the shoes and the jeans. This is like totally something I would just wear. So these are the second pair of shoes. And you guys know I love my Sam Edelman pink loafers. Those are a discontinued style and these are the updated style. So you can see the logo is on it. He did that with his sandals last year as well. These are a really pretty gray color. They came in several different colors. I wanted the gray because I wanted a neutral color. So sorry about the light. You can probably even hear it thundering maybe. So I just love these for throw on, running through the airport. They go good with everything. So here you can see them, you know, with this outfit. Again, something I would totally wear this together. And I just love these shoes. They are just as comfy um, as the pink ones. Again, it just has the logo and I will link them for you below. They were a little hard for me to find at first, um, but I will link them wherever I can find them. And I do size up, size up half a size in these, but I just love them. And again, I liked the pink ones so much. I knew I wanted another color. So these are the second pair. I showed those, these on Instagram. So many of you have purchased these, you said, after seeing them on Instagram and love them. So they are a really good dupe for the Valentino Rock Studs. Of course, they do have an extra strap, but that's what keeps them from being counterfeit. <laughs> so these aren't like something you see on Amazon that people are li literally trying to knock them off their counterfeits. Like these are designer inspired dupes. A lot of companies are making these now, but I actually like these because I just thought they were really, really pretty. Um, they look like they were just made super well. And I like these over a lot of them I had seen over the years trying to copy them. They are really, really comfortable. And again, true to size, you can see my heel goes 
right to the end and without going over. If I would have sized up half in these, they would have been too big. They're very roomy around these straps. So that's what makes them comfortable. Like I think I have them in the last strap, but again, super, super comfortable. So these are the black ones. And again, I just think they're super, super pretty stylish. I know some people don't like these shoes. I just feel like they jazz up any outfit, look very, very pretty, stylish, fun, funky, you know, you name it. Again, here is the black <laughs> as it thunders in the background. I had looked at the original several times, but again, when I looked at cost per wear, I really just couldn't justify it. Um, but I knew I wanted them, so I just think this gives you the same look for less, but it doesn't look totally like knocked off. I don't know, maybe if you have the real ones, you do feel like it looks that way, but um, to me it doesn't look like a fake, like Gucci trying to be Gucci, you know what I mean? Or something like that. I think they're their own shoe enough that they look really pretty. And I wanted to say too, the heel is a really good height to where they are super comfortable. All right, here's the last pair. We're seeing a theme, right? <laughs> my feet are starting to get a little red from trying on different shoes. That's just my skin type. Um, gets red really easily, so. These I saw last year, super, super cute. I didn't buy them, I wish I would've. The only thing I need to say about these is they will take a while to get to you because they're coming from overseas. Again, a Rockstead style dupe. They do have a couple of straps at the top that are adjustable. Now it says a size seven on the bottom, but I think they do go by European sizes. So to me, my heel, goes right to the edge, I don't know. It's not enough over where it's like annoying and my toes are hanging off and all that, but I wish it was just a hair bigger. The only thing about these when I got them is they smelled like glue from where they had glued the insole to the rest of the shoe. But other than that, they came very nicely packaged. I really love this color. I will put the exact details for this color below because it was kind of hard online. I was glad somebody submitted their own picture of these um, so I could see the color because they come in a lot of colors. I just wanted to show you, they came in this really pretty red hard box um, and they were each in like a little protective bag. And I believe there was a, another bag to them as well. But I can't wait to take these on vacation with me. They will look so pretty with spring dresses. And again, with that block heel, they just are gonna be a little more comfortable. So I really appreciate you guys taking the time to watch. And like I said, it's kind of just old school, try on, showing you some cute shoes type of video. Um, follow me on Instagram if you wanna see things styled, if you wanna see when, like I said, things go on sale and I can just put it out real quick. I'll put my name here and it's always listed below. If you guys have any of these um, that you purchased when you saw me post on them or anything like that, I would love to know. Definitely scoop up the jeans. These are a winner for sure. If you are new here, hello and welcome. I would love to have you back, so please subscribe. And thank you guys so much for watching, and I'll see you next time. Bye.